Sorry. I didn't mean for you to get pulled into my personal issues. Don't worry about it. After all, my homeland is in peril, and we've received company approval. So it's okay, right, Alan? Oh, sure! Why would I want to miss out on the fun? Besides, it's not like you ever listened to me. What was that? If you've got something to say, say it. Uh, no, nothing. I'd accompany you to the very depths of hell. Hey, what are you trying to do, jinx us? So, no. getting in won't be difficult, right? Right. There should be no external anti-air defenses, since it was originally constructed as a manufacturing facility. However, security on the inside is most likely still functional. We should be prepared to deal with many active guard machines. Mary, what about the reinforcements from 2nd Milsha? The space-bound units were destroyed in the first blast. It looks like there's a few more on their way, but they won't get here in time. In other words, it's up to us. Looks like it. Guinan, I'm counting on you to cover us. Until we get inside. I have a request of my own as well. Don't let his provocations get to you again. All right? Yeah, I'll be careful. You don't have to worry. I'll take that as a promise. Now don't do anything foolish, little master! ECM levels at maximum. Elsa, you have clearance. Got it. Tony! Aye, sir! We're getting hazard paint with this, right? Okay, we are here. I was expecting a bit more from fair than that, um, but yeah, it's been a while since I last played the game. Um, right, um, I think there's still one more thing I should do to get my party set up correctly. But anyway, welcome back to Proto Merkaba, or welcome to Proto Merkaba, I should say, and welcome back to Season Two, Episode One. Woohoo! And I like this music. I think it's quite pretty. Um, can I push a button here? No, I cannot push the button. That's a shame. Oh, hello, man. There's a great big mech over there. Um, but yeah, this is where you get Chaos's um, strongest weapon. And they did not put that trap there just for show. Okay, so I will need to put a Momo on the party. Place you with you. And bring it. So good. Um, oh, something. <laughs> oh, no, it's Buster. Ooh, yeah. Uh, something. Okay. So we don't get any crazy cross talk. Still standing. Great. How much HP do we have? 
Okay, try you again. And yes, no, he's getting a lot of turns here. I think that's the uh, speed plus my time. Right, so, wow. Yeah, that was speed 25. Okay. Ah, there we go. Holy gloves, meaning gloves with holes in it. Yeah. Um, they do the same. Okay, now for the Himbo to actually tell how much HP these dudes have. That would be nice. Um, first though, Chaos, you have your stuff. Oh, you have nothing else on you, okay. How about... I don't know. The, uh, I don't know. I don't know what to, what to put on you, Mr. Man. Right. Uh, I'm trying to guess that a lot. Anyway. Low replace with Chaos and... Junior replace with Xion. Uh, that's the uh, sort of... Rotation pattern I set up during the uh, grinding run to uh, you know get the uh, get skill points for everyone stuff stuffy stuffy stuffy. I think I will concede that. In favor of search eyes, though. Hmm. Yep. This will do. This will do very well indeed. Um, and zap and click that one up. Okay. We are good. No, nothing here. How peculiar. Uh, okay, we, we are going this way and smashing a droid. So I can show you why the Lunar Blade is uh, such a lot of fun. Oh, hi. And no, I'm not oh, showing you the stupid, awesome. ridiculous, oversized, ridiculous mech here. That's just. That's. Yeah, that's just mean. <laughs> that's video game cruelty. Thousand damage. Okay. Keep you. Ready. Okay, and then Cosmos uh, gets to bring the Ghostbusters there. Angel blow. Keep your pants on. This is gonna be one hell of a bang. Uh, yeah, I think I'll actually waste this one. Charging. Uh, whoa. Okay, critical, but still. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and a 10. Oh, and look at that, 10 as well. Dude, wow, I am wrecking these things. Absolutely taking them to bits. Uh, yeah, like I said. Uh, do you have any. Okay, that's just one enemy. Okay, just for fun. Unleash some of my power. And so I don't have to spam Angel Bow ever. There was another attack, right? That spell is a lot like Annihilation in uh, episode 2. Uh, just uh, so you know, however, it will take 
a shitload of time until I actually get that um, um, annihilation thing. And just look at the amount of skill points there. That's over a hundred for one single battle. Nuts. Seriously. And in here we have the defibrillator vest. In case we were lacking before. Not that we were. Uh, Shion, can you extract something neat, maybe? Yeah, these are all pretty neat things, to be sure. And yeah, we're gonna need these coats. Buster, little boost pack, yeah. Okay. Okay, and apparently it is chirp a drop o'clock <laughs> because bird clocks, All right? So the only way we can go now is forward, and the fight, fights against mechs are going to look basically the same. But I'll show you rain blow now. Just how how much fun that can be. Because I don't know. Um, just, oh, what? Just the one? Oh, okay. Well. Said I will show you rain blade, and I will show you rain blade. Yeah, look at that. I am just wrecking. <laughs> This dungeon here. Uh, okay. And yeah. Nothing more to say about these fights. Or lost souls. May you be reborn again anew. That was altogether uneventful, and uh, incidentally, um, <laughs> if you were wondering, uh, with the uh, um, Junk Circuit A's, if we were ever going to get Junk Circuit B, this is actually where you get them. I just got them.
this is a slight puzzle, not a very challenging one. It's basically race or lower walkways until you can make your way forward. Um, let's see, is there anything here? Ah, oh, there. Very well. First. And. Hello. Okay, so that was just one little Delphi in waiting for us. And if um, anyone, uh, well, if it ever came as a surprise to anyone, Sigi is really not all that good against Moses in this game. I just noticed that. Um, whatever. <coughs> So we're just going to run around here and uh, destroy stuff, basically. Oh, uh, right, I kind of forgot to say this, <clears throat> uh, well, not that it should come as a surprise or anything, uh, but when you do grind for money the way I did uh, by uh, fighting in the Encephalon, the extra benefit is that uh, you get a uh, virtually unlimited amount of uh, medkit and either pack S's. Now let me show you. Uh, see, see this? Well, medkit DX's, uh, you, you get those as drops, but slightly more rare. So, yeah. The ether packs might be an issue here, but in terms of healing by item, well, I'm set for life. <laughs> Essentially. Yeah, yeah, there's the junk circuit B. Which we will never find out how much it's worth because I am not going back to the else before the end of the game. I think. Um, yeah. Okay, well, the jury's out on that. <laughs> uh, but, um, yeah. Uh, we are pretty close to the end of the game. Um, there are a couple of them. Um, Mini bosses and such in the way. Uh, well, well, along the way as well. And a couple of uh, event style fights. And yeah, not that it matters if you creep up. Yeah, okay, whatever. <laughs> uh, but yeah, my opposition is not getting a word in edgewise. It's. Uh, Kind of laughable, <laughs> to be honest. Um, well, the music is nice though. Uh, on uh, the soundtrack CD, it is called Inner Space, although you might only get that on the uh, older edition. It might not be on uh, uh, Yasunori Mitsuda's re release. Okay, let's. Just smack all these mechs before we start monkeying with the switches. Look, seriously, is the game actually supposed to be this easy but by this point? <laughs> I've, I've never just breezed through these fights as much as I do here. It's, I, I don't know what to say. Ah, yeah, that's the angel ring. Um, skill level 5. Okay, never mind. Ooh, and now Mr. Junior is up to skill level 5 as well. Hooray! <coughs> and you have these. You know, craft a right. <coughs> okay. We go on. Or something? Well, <clears throat> um, yeah, it gets really apparent what kind of attack properties uh, these mechs are more vulnerable to. Oh, right, you need, uh, like, 
thousand points right out of my way. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. I mean, you saw how Cosmos and uh, Machion dealt between a thousand and a thousand four hundred with their attacks, or maybe up to one thousand five hundred, fourteen sixty or something. Um, these people here reach uh, somewhere in the eight hundreds. Well, that's still a pretty good smash. I'll jump that. Uh, well, a good whack, I suppose. It's a, <laughs> I suppose that's a better term for it. Um, but, um, yeah. Beam attacks on the way to go here. Uh, let's see. Here we go. Press this. And then this. Start until that. Okay, never mind. So back out here, and we can move on. Always the elevators. <laughs> Seriously. Okay. Come now to floor 40. And I am going to take a slight break here because I have some minis that I should not mention in public, I think. <clears throat> well, anyway, you don't need to hear it. You don't need to hear it. So that's it for this episode. See you in the next one.